autumn fashion lovers and plus size clothing fans welcome to my channel my name is Jana and this is Curves on the Road if you're admiring the beautiful very natural flowers behind me you can thank Mark one of my subscribers hi Mark you missed the flowers in the last video so here they are but to today's topic I went back to Ula Popken. I went there in summer and I felt because of Corona the choices were not that good. It seemed a little pricier than before and I felt like I didn't give it a fair chance. So I'm coming back for the autumn fashion and I'll give you my honest review. Autumn is here, and with it, the motor jackets. This one has gorgeous color and this satin finish. You know, it's like velvety, very, very nice. Of course, La Popkin, come on. This is the size of the sleeve for the 52. I don't think so. The same story every time in Pull Up Up Can, just the arms are too small for me to wear. Otherwise, it's perfectly fine. I can zip it up. And I love these details. They are on the pockets. It has pockets. And it also has it in the back. This shirt cost 90 euros, 89.99. It's gorgeous i love it especially when i just need to cover my arms a little bit and then i want something sheer it looks stunning the only problem i was hoping that inside it won't be as scratchy as outside and yeah it's it's very uncomfortable i am feeling like ants are crawling around me so if you just need something to look fabulous and you'll wear long sleeve under it you can do it but wearing it as me you wouldn't feel comfortable but I love the cut I love the idea everything about it except for the scratchiness it has golden thread in it and some of it is more metallic or silver so the design is everything too bad it's so scratchy this one would go home We have 40 euro top here, and it's so cute. The kisses on it, I'm thinking Valentine's date, maybe, somewhere romantic, or just when you want to look cute for yourself. This is a candidate to go home. This is a total bummer. Arms, come on, okay. Be reasonable. Make the material stretchy. I'm repeating it for years and years and no progress. Absolutely nobody hears me. This shirt, and like, nobody likes this part. You know, the final hem to be smaller than the rest. It just makes you constricted. If you don't have big butt, it just makes your tummy look bigger. No, not a good design. No. Material, I have pants that are my sacred pants that I wear when I fly and they are very gorgeous and they are always dry because they always suck the sweat. So I was hoping this shirt would be the counterpart as a top, but no. It cost actually 60 euros. Oh my goodness, I mean, the quality is good, but 60 euros? When did the prices skyrocketed like this? Did I spend two years in quarantine? Yes, I did, but come on, that's too much. And we have our first winner. Love this, love this, love this color. 
gorgeous and the material is the softest most comfortable thing you have ever worn gorgeous lovely love it and i think i look good again but test pass cute it's a little pricey it's 80 euros this is the length i realize that on my pants it's not very well visible so here here's the hem 80 euros oh my god this is again the marvelous material i was talking about it is soft and it really doesn't make you sweaty so it's perfect I like even the dark blue, that's one of the colors I like. It has a rubber band around the well wrist, I think you can put it at your elbow as well. It has little tassels, you can open it a little bit, there is like a little keyhole here. It costs 50 euros, which is okay compared to the other ones, better. And it's fine, it's nice. I love the material. These jeans are the biggest bummer. I love, love, love the design. It's there, but it's not there. It's so much fun. The problem, zero stretch in the material. Why? Why? And like, okay, if it was like sophisticated jean, right? But these are, there is not even a zipper. So there are supposed to be somewhat sweatpants, hands comfortable, hands stretch. No, oh, give me stretch. I think for all of you who want pockets, look, I'll put my legs straight. Look what you've done. This, if it wasn't for your stupid, stupid pockets, these pants would be a-okay like this. Unwarranty, I have one more wrinkle than my own. No, 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 no. Please, girls, stop fighting for pockets. It's not doing anything. I'm trying it. These pants, I love the design. It's cheetah, but like it's a subtle cheetah. You have to be like, okay, okay, brown pants, brown pants, fine. But there's cheetah. So I love this kind of, you know, subtle details that you can just discover when you get closer. It's something like when you meet people, you have to see the details only when you're close. They are quite comfortable. They wrinkle weirdly on the knees for some reason. I'll try one size bigger. They are not too high. They are, you know, they are ending right here, which is okay, but I prefer mine to be really high waisted. And the top, I prefer the blue one. Please let me know down in comments do you prefer this one or the blue one? For me, the blue is younger and more flattering for my complexion. Do you love cats? Do you plan having lots of them? Do you want to be the old cat lady? Here's the outfit. This is perfect if you plan to have 20 cats. Surround yourself with them and when you go out you still want to carry them at least in the print on your shirt. I don't know how I would wear it. I guess it's a dress. Of course it's a dress. It's like a midi dress. And I love the idea of the subtle cats on it, but otherwise, where? Where do you wear it? I'm, I'm confused. Here's the final attempt to find something nice, cute here at Ola Hopkin. Wish me luck. I'll try it on. Actually, I'm in. It has quite a lot of stretch. The bands, the bands should have this stretch. This is fine. This is perfect. Fits over my hips. Great. No problem at all. Is it something I would normally wear? I think I would have to start going apple picking, which I've never done before. Do you go apple picking in the autumn? Well, 
I don't know, I'm not a farm girl, I'm the city girl all over, so I'm not sure if that goes into my aesthetic, but yeah, it is what I expected it to be. Does it kill my waist a little bit? Yes. But yeah, it is exactly what I expected it to be and it fits, so thumbs up for that. It costs 60 euros. I really don't know. I would really need your help on this one. Yes? No? Can you see me in that running around? I honestly, honestly don't know. Does it look good with the pants? I probably wouldn't be confident enough to wear it without the pants. I don't know guys, please leave me down in the comments if to keep this one or not. This is a dress that you can wear in winter, just put a light white or any colored shirt under it and it can be fine. It's comfortable, it's a nice knit material, it flatters quite nicely, let's try to belt it. Else, but what do you think? Oh, I'm so indecisive today. So, to sum it up, overpriced, they are not listening to their customer. I've been sending them messages about changing the design to fit my arms for a year now, and the designs are just so old and so uninventive compared to Shein. I know that Shein borrows the designs from the designers, but come on, there's a fine line between getting inspired and stealing. So I think even Ola Popken could get inspired and they should not think that because you're plus size, you just want to wear a bag of potatoes on your body. No, I was highly disappointed. This was the first time I didn't buy a single piece there. Everything was just wrong. Will I return to Opopkin? I don't know. The saddest thing is there are not that many options for plus size clothing here in Brno that I could actually try in a physical store and overspending on Shein feels wrong. So I'll probably go there again, but yeah, it's being disappointment after disappointment. So that's it. That's the whole video. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please give me an awesome thumb up. And why don't you subscribe to my channel? I upload every Sunday. I do fashion and traveling. Thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely rest of your day. And bye!